First, we went out to Ted Drews. It is located off of Chippewa and Jameson in St. Louis City. Ted Drews has been a historic Route 66 destination in St. Louis for over 75 years. Um, the Ted Drews chocolate ice cream was, it was good, but it wasn't as good as their vanilla ice cream is, so I would still like recommend people to go down there just because Ted Drews is cool, but um, I wouldn't get the chocolate ice cream, I'd get the vanilla ice cream, like one of their concretes or something is better than their chocolate ice cream for sure. Next we headed over to Andy's Frozen Custard. It's located in downtown Kirkwood off of Kirkwood Road, right across the street from Five Star Burger. Andy's came to Kirkwood at the end of the 2013 summer and has turned into a very popular spot to grab ice cream after dinner. Andy's ice cream was really good. It tasted like, like real chocolate ice cream. It was just really um, <laughs> rich. It was really good and it's really close to home, you know, like five minute drive from anyone. So it's really convenient to go there and it's really good ice cream. Lastly, we headed over to the Custard Station. It is located off of Clay and Argonne in downtown Kirkland. The Custard Station has been a family favorite spot to get ice cream for many years. However, we did not think it was the best. Um, the Custard Station chocolate ice cream definitely was not that good. It, um, their vanilla ice cream is a lot better or like if you get one of their um, cements or something, tastes a lot better than just the plain chocolate ice cream. It just kind of left like a weird aftertaste, but it is still really close and it's like a cute little Kirkwood thing, so I'd for sure still go there. I would say Andy's, Ted Drew's, and then Custard Station.